Recent discoveries, from heat-resistant corals clinging to sunlit reefs to bioluminescent wonders in the twilight zone, hint at the incredible diversity that awaits us. Today, we embark on a journey a deep dive to explore the wonders that unfold as sunlight fades and pressure mounts through the ocean layers. Packed with recent discoveries in each layer, this dive will reveal the ocean's hidden secrets in a whole new light. Even the shoreline can offer a glimpse into the deep. Here, the currents have deposited a most unexpected visitor, a creature from the abyss. Just recently, a rare deep sea fish, the Pacific football fish, surprised everyone with its unexpected arrival on Cannon Beach, Oregon. This discovery highlights the potential impact of currents on deep sea creatures. As sunlight weakens, we descend from the sun-drenched surface towards the continental shelf, a vibrant ecosystem teeming with life. Lush coral reefs, once thought to be resilient, face new challenges due to a warming ocean. However, recent discoveries offer a glimmer of hope. Scientists have identified specific strains of coral that are more resistant to rising temperatures. These super corals offer a potential path for reef restoration efforts. Understanding their resilience could be key to protecting these vital ecosystems. But the continental shelf isn't just about coral reefs. Recent expeditions have revealed a surprising diversity of creatures in this zone. In 2024, Researchers off the coast of Norway discovered a new species of bioluminescent jellyfish, unlike anything seen before. This finding highlights the importance of continued exploration, even in seemingly familiar areas. The continental shelf may be a sunlit zone, but it's a complex and ever-changing environment. As we delve deeper into the twilight zone, we'll see how this vibrant ecosystem connects to the mysterious world below. Descending further, we enter the twilight zone, where sunlight weakens with each meter. Here, Creatures like jellyfish and viperfish illuminate their path with an eerie bioluminescent glow. This internal light allows them to hunt, attract mates, and navigate the perpetual dusk. Recent studies suggest these bioluminescent adaptations might even inspire the design of next-generation underwater robots, helping us explore the deep sea more efficiently. As we delve deeper, the continental shelf gives way to a dramatic slope in the midnight zone. This is the continental slope, a vibrant ecosystem teeming with life. Lush coral reefs, home to an astonishing diversity of fish, invertebrates, and even deep sea sharks cling to the rocky cliffs. Here, the dance of life unfolds in a symphony of color and movement. A recent discovery revealed a new species of crab living 3,000 feet under the ocean surface on the South China Sea continental slope. This finding highlights the incredible biodiversity that remains hidden even in familiar areas of the deep sea.
Leaving the continental slope behind, we enter the abyssal plain. Here, sunlight is a distant memory, replaced by the faint glow of bioluminescent organisms. The pressure is immense, and the temperature is near freezing. Yet, life persists in remarkable forms. We encounter anglerfish with their bioluminescent lures, basket stars with long, sinuous arms, and tripod fish that stand erect using a modified fin ray. This ecosystem supports a bizarre array of creatures, including eyeless shrimp, giant two worms, and blind crabs, all adapted to survive in this extreme environment. A recent discovery sheds light on the formation of the mysterious holes that pepper the abyssal plain seabed. Scientists now suggest these pits might be formed by super salty brine seeping through cracks in the Earth's crust. Deep within the Phoenix Islands archipelago, at a staggering 651 meters below the surface, researchers from the Schmidt Ocean Institute captured a rare glimpse of a glass octopus on a seamount along the Takalau Ridge. This elusive cephalopod is one of the least studied, with most information gleaned from specimens found in predators' stomachs. True to its name, the glass octopus boasts an almost entirely transparent body. Remarkably, you can even see its yellow chromatophores, the tiny color-changing cells typically used for camouflage. The only opaque parts are its eyes, optic nerve, and digestive tract. Unlike bottom-dwelling octopuses, this fascinating creature is pelagic, gracefully drifting through the vast open ocean. Dotting the abyssal plain are hydrothermal vents, volcanic fissures spewing superheated, mineral-rich water. These vents create oases of life in the vast, dark ocean. Here, we find chemosynthetic bacteria that thrive on the dissolved chemicals, forming the base of a unique food chain. This ecosystem supports a bizarre array of creatures, including eyeless shrimp, giant two worms, and blind crabs, all adapted to survive in this extreme environment. A recent discovery revealed a whole new ecosystem thriving beneath these hydrothermal vents. Scientists from the Schmidt Ocean Institute found evidence that vent animals, like two worms, might travel underneath the seafloor through vent fluid to colonize new habitats. This finding challenges our understanding of how these deep sea creatures reproduce and disperse. Our journey reaches its final destination, the deepest trenches on Earth. Here, in the crushing darkness and immense pressure, life takes on its most resilient forms. We encounter strange, translucent creatures with gelatinous bodies, able to withstand the crushing pressure. This final frontier continues to hold many secrets, waiting to be discovered as technology allows us to explore even further. Recent studies suggest the impact of solar flares might even reach these extreme depths. Scientists are still figuring out the full effects, but this discovery throws light on how interconnected our planet truly is. Ocean Network's Canada's OSC observatories spread across the Arctic to the Antarctic, recorded unusual activity linked to recent solar flares. These observatories, equipped with over 12,000 sensors including compasses for measuring currents, detected significant anomalies in the Earth's magnetic field. Notably, a compass near Vancouver Island at the Neptune Observatory hung dramatically between 30 and minus 30 degrees, highlighting the potential impact of solar flares on even the deepest parts of the ocean.
As we ascend back to the surface, we carry with us a newfound appreciation for the diversity and resilience of life in the deep sea. This hidden world, though seemingly alien, is intricately connected to our own. Protecting this vast and fragile ecosystem is vital for the health of our planet. Despite these incredible discoveries, the deep sea remains largely unexplored. While an estimated 240,000 marine species have been discovered and named to date, according to the ocean census, only around 2,200 new species are identified each year on average. This means a vast majority of the ocean's inhabitants remain unknown. With each dive, each new technology, and each dedicated researcher, we unlock a piece of this underwater mystery. The future of deep sea exploration is bright, promising even more awe-inspiring revelations about the hidden layers of our planet. Thank you for joining us on this deep dive. The ocean's secrets continue to unfold, and with each discovery, we gain a deeper understanding of this extraordinary realm. Let's continue to explore, learn, and protect this vital part of our world.